Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, don't forget to click the subscribe button and hit the notification bell so that you can get notified every time that I post a new video. So today we're gonna be using the Mini Controversy Palette by Shane Dawson and Jeffree Star Cosmetics. Okay, so this is what the palette looks like inside. It has like this small mirror. It's perfect for when you're traveling. It's very small, you can put it in any bag. So this palette comes with six matte shades and it comes with three shimmery shades so the first shade i'm going to be using is the shade controversy and it is this purple right here so there isn't a lot of fallout on the pan so that's a good sign and i'm gonna be applying this on my crease my greñas are in the way okay so it's actually applying very smoothly and i'm not getting any fallout on my face Mm, it's very easy to blend too. Let's just do the other eye real quick. Okay, now next I'm going to be blending out that shade with a clean brush. say <laughs> My dog doesn't shut up. So next I'm going to be using a clean brush to blend that shade out. It blends good, but it's taking me a while. Can't blend this. It like stuck onto my skin where I applied it and I'm like struggling to blend it. It's okay, we'll make it work right now. <gasps> my head hurts. Okay, so for the next step, we're gonna cut the crease with the Believe Beauty concealer. I'm gonna go ahead and cut the crease real quick. Alright, I'm just gonna cut the crease on my other eye real quick. Right, the crease has been cut. Okay, so the next shade I'm gonna be using is called Exposed and it's a light purple. It's focus camera, this purple right here. I'm gonna make sure I grab a lot. There's a lot of fallout with this shade. Alright, and I'm only gonna be applying this where that concealer was put. Ooh, this is pretty. It's powdery, but it's very pretty. Oof. Okay, this is coming out really nice. It is very powdery, but it's very smooth. So it goes on very, very smooth. The reason why I decided to use a small brush though is so that I can really get in there. Okay, now that this shade is applied, I'm going to be going in with my Apology. And it's this shade right here. There's not really a lot of colors that you can match together on this palette, but it's okay, we can break the rules. Like I said, do we want to look like a raccoon? Then you go and look like a fucking raccoon. It's okay. I'm going to be applying this shade on this outer corner right here. So it has like a extra pop with a different shade. So we're going to add this on the outer corner and blend it in with that light purple called Exposed. I like it. It actually is applying really good. All right, so this shade is having like a little bit of fallout, but that's okay. And there's nothing we cannot fix. Yes, if you want to look like you have a purple eye, it's okay. We can look like we got punched in the face. All right, now I'm going back in with that same brush and the shade Controversy. And I'm going to apply that on this outer corner just to blend out those shades. The same on the other side. And then we are going to go in with that so-called clean brush, no powder, and we're going to blend it out right there. Okay, so now that that is settled, let's clean out all this like fallout on our face so we can go on. So sassy. My hair. Now that that is gone. Okay, so next, I'm going to be applying the shade Controversy. It's this purple. And we're going to be applying this on our lower lash line. Very tightly in there. If you're sensitive to, like, powder, I don't recommend you do this. Because, yes, bitch, you're going to get some powder in those eyes. Okay, it's coming on pretty good. Sorry, it was getting a little dark. I had to turn on my ring light. This look is actually coming out way better than I thought it was going to be. It's because purple shades are very, very hard to work with. Most of the time it looks like I have a purple eye. 
And this actually looks really pretty. Oh, yeah. Okay, so I'm going to go back in with the shade My Apology now. And I'm going to also put this on my lower lash line. Emily, Emily, you're so amazing. <gasps> okay, so the next shade I'm going to be applying is called My Boyfriend's Purse. What? It's this shade right here. I'm gonna grab a little bit. I'm not gonna spray this with anything because I wanna see how it applies without any other product. Ooh, girl, get it. It's actually really pretty. Now next, I'm gonna be grabbing a flat brush and I'm gonna be applying that same shade onto my brow bone. Just to add that extra pop. I'm trying not to apply too much because I don't want it to be too, too, too bright. Alright, let's do the same thing to the other side real quick. Ooh, so bright. Okay, now I'm going to go back in with that so-called clean blending brush. And I'm going to blend this out so that it blends in with the other shade. And I'm also gonna blend out the bottom here together so that it doesn't look like it's just on there. Then we really are gonna look like we have a purple eye. And we don't want that, do we? Now we are gonna be going in with the Better Than Sex mascara. And we're just gonna apply some light coats because we are gonna be using some false lashes. Okay, now that we are done with the mascara, we are going to be applying our spiders. What? Don't look at me like I'm crazy. These are my spiders. These are actually a new style from Mink Luxury Lashes. So let's see how these look. Let's apply just enough glue for these bad boys. Mis arañas. Oof. Okay, I think these arañas are like the same size as mine. I've always called my eyelashes arañas. Why? Sepa. Oh, okay, okay. Así si puedo ir al baile. I'm just gonna like stick my hand outside the door so it can like dry because it's so windy outside. <laughs> always make sure that when you're applying your eyelashes, you like close your eye a little bit and press down on them like this. Try not to touch the glue because then it comes off. But that's like the blink test. When you blink, you gotta make sure that they look good when you close your eye. Next, I'm gonna be applying my eyeliner on my lower lash line. And I'm gonna be using a little spongy to pull down my skin because I don't wanna like mess up my foundation. Careful not to poke your eye when you do this because it hurts. Okay, how does that look? Okay, so my final opinion on this palette, based on the colors that I used, I love it. I like it. I was having some trouble blending, like, the purple shade controversy. But other than that, I love it. I think it's really nice, and it's small. You carry it anywhere. I like the mirror, and I think it came out really, really good. So I actually really liked it. I'm going to zoom in so you guys can see what this looks like up close. Okay, so this is what it looks like up close. So yeah, guys, that is the final look. I hope you guys liked this video and enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to click the subscribe button and hit the big thumbs up. And I'll see you guys in the next video.